Hello everyone, in this video we are solve a wonderful exponential equation. This equation is x plus 11 whole to the power 4 minus x plus 9 whole to the power 4 is equal to 80 x is equal to what? How to solve this interesting mass Olympiad question. So here is x plus 11 and here is x plus 9. So first of all our question it will be x plus 11 and whole to the power 4 minus x plus 9 and whole to the power 4 is equal to 18. This is our question. Now I can easily this question look x plus 11. So I can easily this x plus 11 it will be x plus 10 plus 1 and whole to the power 4 look you know that x here is 10 plus 1 10 plus 1 it will be 11 minus and it will be look here is 9 so i can say that it will be x plus 10 and minus 1 and whole to the power 4 is equal to 18. look i take here is 10 again but i subtract 1 you know that 10 minus 1 it will be 9 then this equation look here is x plus 10 look and this is x plus 10 so let here is let x plus 10 it will be y so we'll let x plus 10 it will be y then if i put this value this y in this equation so we'll find out it will be y plus 1 whole to the power 4 y plus 1 whole to the power 4 minus and it will be y minus 1 whole to the power 4 is equal to 80. Now in this expression I can say easily y plus 1 whole to the power 4 it will be y plus 1 whole to the power 2 and here is again to you know that exponential law 2 times 2 it will be 4 minus and it will be y minus 1 whole to the power 2 bracket and here is 2 2 times 2 will be 4 is equal to 18. Then look, we know that a plus v whole square will be, we know that a plus v whole square will be a square plus 2ab plus v square. And we know that a minus v whole square is also a square minus 2ab plus v square. According to this rule, if I follow both rules, I can easily this equation y plus 1 whole to the power 2. It will be y square plus 2y plus 1 and whole to the power 2. This 2. Then, and it is also y square minus 2y plus 1 whole to the power 2. This 2 is equal to 18. Yes, now look here is y square plus 1, here is y square plus 1. Again, let y square plus 1 it will be a, and if I let here is 2y, so 2y it will be v. Then I can say really, here is y square plus 1, it will be a, and 2y will let it will be v. So it will be v and whole to the power 2 minus and in this expression here is y square plus 1 it will be a but minus 2y it will be v well at here 2y it will be v is equal to 80 and here is a square then look you know that a plus v whole square minus a minus v whole square the algebraic rule it will be 4 a v so i can say that it will be 4 a v is equal to 18 then if I divide both sides by 4, we will find out here is a v is equal to 20. Good. Now, remember that recall a is equal to y square plus 1 and v is equal to 2y. I put this value in this equation. So a it will be y square plus 1 times b is equal to 2y is equal to 20. It is interesting maths. Okay. Now, if I divide both sides by 2, I can say it will be y times 
y square plus 1 is equal to 10 I divide both set by 2 then it will be y to the power 3 y squared times y it will be y to the power 3 y times 1 to the y is equal to 10 then I can say it will be y cube plus y minus 10 is equal to 0 we are find out it is an interesting exponential equation and we'll find out what is the y what is the value of y in this exponential equation okay so in this expression i can say it will be y to the power 3 plus y and 10 it will be minus 8 minus 2 is equal to 0 8 minus 2 minus 8 minus 2 both sign are same so it will be minus 10 then it will be y to the power 3 minus 8 plus y minus 2 is equal to 0. I just change the place. Here is minus 8. I take here. Then it will be y to the power 3 minus 8. It will be 2 to the power 3. And it will be y minus 2 is equal to 0. Then we know that a cube minus v cube. It will be a minus b times s square plus a v plus b square. According to algebraic rules. I can easily this equation becomes y minus 2 times y squared plus 2y plus 4 and here is 1 is common and this math equation it will be y minus 2 is equal to 0 yeah now in this expression I can see easily here is y minus 2 is common yeah so here is y minus 2 and this divide this it will be y square plus 2y plus 4 and this divide this it will be plus 1 is equal to 0 then this equation becomes y minus 2 times y square plus 2y plus 5 is equal to 0 yeah now we'll find out here is two case our first case is y minus 2 is equal to 0 and other case we'll find out y square plus 2y plus 5 is equal to 0 so I can see really this equation it will be y minus 2 is equal to 0 and here is y square plus 2y plus 5 is equal to 0 then if I move on this to in this side it will be y is equal to 2 and here look it will be v square v 2 square minus 4 ac is 1 and v c is 5 then we'll find out here is 2 square will be 4 minus 20 then it will be minus 16 less than 0 so in this case we'll find out two complex solution no real solution no real solution but we need real solution okay so here is y is equal to 2 but recall first of all we will add y it will be x plus 10 yeah so i can see really this y recall y is equal to x plus 10 so it will be x plus 10 is equal to 2 then i can see really x is equal to 2 minus 10 then we'll find out here is x is equal to minus 8 this is our final answer in this mass olympiad question let's check out our question is x plus 11 whole to the power 4 minus x plus 9 whole to the power 4 is equal to 80 this is our question but at this moment we'll find out x is equal to minus 8 so i put this value in this equation minus 8 plus 11 whole to the power 4 minus 8 plus 9 whole to the power 4 is equal to 80 and then i can easily look 11 minus 4 uh, 11 minus 8 it will be 3 yeah so 3 to the power 4 minus and it will be 1 1 to the power 4 it will be 1 is equal to 80 then uh it will 3 to the power 4 it's mean 3 times 3 times 3 times 3 it will be 81 minus 1 is equal to 80 then i can say really 81 minus 1 it will be 80 is equal to 80 so i can say uh, here is x is equal to minus 8 
This is our right answer in this mass Olympiad question. Thank you all if you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe my channel for other interesting video. Goodbye. Take care.